Welcome back to Endangered Species Spotlight. This week we are talking about the Orinoco Crocodile. The Orinoco Crocodile is a rather large species of crocodile that is only found in the Orinoco River Basin in Venezuela and Colombia. They are considered to be critically endangered with a population that is currently unconfirmed but estimated to be between 250 and 1,000 or so individuals. They are affected by habitat loss in the basin, but the main reason for them being endangered was hunting for their skins. Crocodile leather, again specifically Orinoco crocodile leather, was very, very highly sought after, so the population of Orinoco crocodiles were almost entirely decimated due to the demand. They were protected in the 1970s, and there are conservation efforts going on to save them, but the population still does need quite a lot of help. Attacks from the Orinoco crocodile are quite rare, and deaths from them even more rare. This is in part due to the quite a small population. There just aren't that many Orinoco crocodiles around to attack people. Crocodilians in general tend to do pretty okay in captivity, so there are a number of captive breeding programs established to protect and reestablish the Orinoco crocodile. There's a few good populations in zoos around the world, as well as breeding programs that focus on increasing the population to release later in the wild. It is illegal to hunt or trap or otherwise harm the Orinoco crocodiles, and there are also efforts in place to kind of protect the remaining habitat, because the Orinoco River Basin is an important place not just for these crocodiles, but many other rare and unique animals that live there. There are many protected areas along the whole length of the Orinoco River, and in both Colombia and Venezuela, these guys are pretty heavily protected. While these guys are still considered to be very heavily endangered and are one of the rarest crocodilians in the world, the population has increased since the 70s when they became a protected species. And with all of the conservation efforts and protection and everything that is being done to protect these animals, hopefully we will see a massive increase of the population in the future and they may even come off of the endangered species list, hopefully.